everyone and welcome to my channel and if you are new, hi I'm Raquel, please like this video and subscribe. So today I am going to be doing a very cool video. So it is getting to be the end of the year and I am graduating this year, grade 8, and I'm so excited. Um, there is about two weeks of school left, so five days plus four days, so nine days of school left, not counting the weekend. So, getting to the end of the year, so really we only have like four more days of work, um, because then we're doing like the fun things and stuff. So yes, so today I'm going to show you, um, my art things from this year, 2016 and 17, because we got our art back this today. So I'm going to show you guys, um, my artwork from our class this year and I hope you guys enjoy so I have a few projects and then I'm going to show you my sketchbook which my art teacher provided for us so like my random sketches and stuff so I hope you guys enjoy and let's get right into the video so before we start off with that I wanted to show you this my friend made me this and her name is Leanne and she made me this it says mochi 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 yeah thoughts and she drew this so it's pretty cool um all those different pictures feelings so i thought i would show you that before i show you my artwork so let's get into the video so to start us off i will start off with the very first project that we did this year and that was this here I don't know if you can see that. No, you probably can't. Okay, so this is what the first project was this year. And I got a pretty good mark on it. Um, but this is what I did. So I did three different characters. I did Mickey Mouse. I did Levo from Levo and Stitch, and then down here I did Joy from Inside Out. So basically these are like char characters, and we had to do, the reason the lines are like through the faces is because that's what we were supposed to do, the different lines of how you make a person or a character or whatever. So I will tell you my value statements and quotes that I wrote. So for Mickey Mouse, um, his friends are important to him. His, um, Joy, her family and friends are very important to her. She, she is important to me because we both are really happy, have a really happy personality and we get excited easily about things. And then my quote by Lilo is, Ohana means family, family means nobody gets left behind or forgotten. Um, and then Lila was important to me because her interest in personality makes me happy. So that is the first art project that we've done. Okay, and then... So next, what we did is... This project where... It's kind of like a collage, but we had to draw like all these pictures here, all different things, and these are all of mine, and I combined them all together, and then we had to paint it. So that is my overall project. And while we were doing that project, we did this. This is a really bad job, but we did this circle of like different shades, painting little exercise, and it's really bad. But yes, and then this last project that we've done is we did printmaking so this is my printmaking here so we had to carve these pictures and then print them onto here so i did two different designs and yes and i lied this wasn't our last project we're actually doing a play project right now but i don't have it here to show you right now so now I'm going to show you my sketchbook, which is like my rough drawings and just random drawings. So I hope, let's get into this one. So in the beginning of the year, we had to do this creative process thing, just glued on our 
cover of our drawing book. So we did that. And then here we had to do this on the first page of what is art and what is a gesture. So we just did that. So what that first drawing thing activity that I showed you is called a gesture drawing. So we did some of the teachers and how to like draw the shapes of them and trace them. And then here I have these figures that we had to trace. Here you can see the lines, that's how we did them. And then here is just um, the project, like the success criteria of the project. Okay, and then we had to do some like rough work. Uh, five minute drawings um, for those, so I did this one and this one. Okay, and then this is my joy from inside out rough copy. And then I just drew this random tree there. I don't know why. And then this is my random dog skull thing. I just drew that. This is Lilo rough copy. And then I just drew a picture of me. This is really bad. And then we, okay, and then that's the end of that project kind of thing. And then we had to do cubism, the big painting one that I showed you. We had to put the different angles of this water bottle there. Um, um, and then here we had to do what is cubism. Here are some professional paintings there. And then we had to write it down there what is cubism. And then we, I just drew that for randomness, call it, yeah. Uh, but we had to do examples of cubism, so that's my example. And then I just drew a picture of me. And then, so we had to go around the class and draw these different things that were together for examples of cubism. So this is the first one. It is a hockey stick, a water jug, and a backpack. This one is like my favorite. So we had a vase, a little bunny, a fish, random stuff there. This one is a picnic basket, a jar, hockey stick, different things. Okay, this one. This one. It was different angles of things. The cubism. And then this one. This one. This one. This one. Oh, so wait, no. This here, sorry, this was some examples of what I wanted to do. Okay. And then one day I got really bored and started drawing app icons for fun. So that's what that is. And then here's my things of what I've done on that project. So Apple, and I had to do different kinds of beats of Apple. And then I did Mug. Did Bed and Cone there. Cone. Bed. And then I got bored and drew a house. And then here I just drew the cupcake that I've done. I drew parts of my house. So this is my main floor, just for fun. Main floor. And then this is my living room. This is my dining room and this is my kitchen. And then I also did a phone and a Rubik's Cube for the project, so I did that. Um, a pot to be in the lamp. Okay, and this is my second living room. This is my main washroom. 
Okay, then we have to do the color wheel and color values. So this is the color wheel and then the values of one color. Here, my basement and then my washroom. And then my bedroom and my playroom. So this is my bedroom, this is my playroom. Here, we need to do print work. So we have to do artist work for that and then print making success criteria sheet to write, uh, answer questions about print making. And then I did my, some examples of the things that I've done. And then these were all symbols that we had to do for the print making. These were just ideas. And then I just pulled around the symbols there, and then here was what it looked like, my printmaker. Example, and then I drew scribbles, literally, on this page, and on this page. Yes, fun scribbles. And then I drew another picture of me. I don't know what that is. It's just a random picture. And, oh, okay, so... Then, last thing that I've ever done in my sketchbook is, so our last project we had to do these characters, caricatures, which are like um, characters or something that have like big heads or something like that. So I drew m and m and we had to make the characters out of clay. So I, I just drew this as a rough copy. I didn't want to do m and I just drew it. But I decided to do my dad. Yes, that's my drawing, and it actually looks like him. And so that's my drawing of him, and I finished sculpting him. So yeah, I did my dad. I'm a nice person. So that is my art little haul kind of thing, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And it's a year full of hard artwork. Hard, not really hard, but fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and my book is falling apart. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you on my next. Bye!